Hello dear friends and students welcome to our next tutorial. In this tutorial we will learn how we can make return type methods in Android. I will make two methods. One method will get current date and return its value. We will also format date. Second method will return image bytes of image bitmap. Keep it in your mind that we are doing all of this work to save data in SQLite local database. In SQLite image can be saved only as blob. For it we need to convert image bitmap to byte array. Let me start it. Before last bracket we will create this method private string get current date string current date and return this string current date This is a return type method of getting current date. We will write here some other code. Simple date format. Date format. Is equal to new. Simple date format. To get current date, we will write a code of date is equal to new date. This will return current date and our current date will be equal date format dot format date pass this current date value in it we have successfully written this code for making for getting cr uh, current date now we will create other method private byte this is its return type get image byte is method name here input type is bitmap write here some code for converting this image bitmap to byte array byte array output stream select this one make its object here stream output stream and this here and bitmap dot compress bitmap dot compress format dot png image quality 100% and stream output is this now we have to return image byte array stream dot to byte array this simple method will make image bytes of bitmap image bitmap now we will test this method is this method working or not we will call this method here 
we can access this method here get ground date and run debugger here and test is this working or not play this go to your register screen press this button it has successfully running in go here and check it's giving here some date current date is 5 13 18 and 12 24 pm this is here we are we can also use date format here write some date format month day and hours and minutes run it again check now the date format will be different year is coming first then month and then day and then time and below is another method to convert image bitmap to byte array this will we will use this method in our next tutorial when we will save data in our local database in next tutorial we will start creating local database by creating its class thank you for watching my this tutorial and don't forget to share this video with your friends thank you take care